South Korea's finance ministry has released a booklet that outlines several policy changes that will take effect from next month. This includes an expansion of state employment insurance and the maximum 52-hour working week to smaller firms. Min Suk Hyun with the details. Starting next month, more types of work will be included under the state employment insurance. This includes employees hired under special contracts such as insurance agents, parcel delivery workers, door-to-door -door salespeople, and after-school instructors. They now can receive unemployment benefits when they lose their jobs and can apply for benefits related to maternity leave. But those whose monthly earnings are below 710 U.S. dollars will not be eligible, nor will those aged 65 and older. The insurance premium is set at 1.4 percent, with the employee and employer each required to pay half of the fee. The government aims to extend its employment insurance to all employees by 2025. South Korea will also expand its 52-hour work week to smaller companies. Currently, the weekly hours only apply to firms with 50 or more employees. But from July 1st, this will be extended to businesses with between 5 and 49 workers. Those with fewer than 5 workers will not be affected. The country started phasing in the 52-hour workweek scheme from 2018 to improve working conditions for employees. Starting July, the length of visas for foreigners will be limited to their passport expiration date. This means an applicant whose passport is set to expire in six months can only be granted with a six-month stay, even if he or she is eligible for a two-year extension. The country had previously been granting period-of-stay extensions for foreigners, regardless of their passport validity. But the change comes as there have been difficulties in accurately tracking the immigration status of foreigners in Korea. The measure, however, will not apply to permanent resident, recognized refugee and humanitarian status visa holders. The Ministry of Justice recommends that foreigners check their passport and renew them, if necessary, ahead of their visa application. Min Suk Hyun, Arirang News.